Am I up? There we go. We are live. Welcome back, everybody, new and old, to what is most likely the conclusion of Resident Evil 1 with Jill. What is up, Resident is Evil? What is up, Wesker? I wonder what happened to those old movie trailers with the guy like talking over in a world let me be your guide to the end of the world all right hookah what what yeah every time without fail so we're playing with we are currently playing with Jill's alternate skin. But I do want to get to uh, Evil Within. So I think once we finish with Jill, it's going to be it's going to be Evil Within. Um, I mean, maybe we can revisit it later at a later date. But I think this is like my seventh or eighth stream with this game. So I think we'll be jumping to Evil Within here soon. All right, where are we? Where are we at? What are we doing? I think we've cleared pretty much everywhere out. Puka, kill me, bud. I love you. But you gotta stop, buddy. Sleeping all day. The moment I push go live, he starts messing around. Okay, so we've got the emblem key. So we can go out and get that door, get the other, uh, the other medallion. And yeah, I think we've like cleared everything except that door. I don't know how to get to that door. Oh, I wonder if that was the, I wonder if that was the shotgun area. What is up, James? How are you doing? Good morning, everybody. I'm surprised I even made it on time. Honestly, I my alarm didn't go off right, so I woke up like 13 minutes before the stream and had to rush and get a shower. So yeah, that's that's how my morning is going. Let's see, let's store these. So I did it with a couple of characters, actually. I did it with uh with Wesker and with with Leon, I got S's on both of them. Wesker was honestly a lot of fun. I love Wesker's uh, melee. And Leon was a little tougher since he doesn't have the that long distance melee. Let's see, what do I want to bring? Acid rounds, swagnum. Oh, we can do the battery. Let's do this too. And let's do the emblem key. So let's do the emblem key first. That's true, yeah. Wesker does, like, start with a swagnum, and it's pretty great. All right, let's go hit that emblem key. And now he's sprinting around the apartment. What a weird cat. Strange, strange animal. You can also unlock Hunk in that mode, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, so, how though because i know that character is uh like he's grayed out and there's no like information on how to unlock him no no you're all good wesker you are all good you got stuff to do you got stuff to do whoop 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 juked stupid zombies uh let's see where am i going i'm gonna go to the main hall since we opened that one door it's a lot easier to to get to that area. It was so much easier to open it as Jill, too. Oh, there's that other door way over there. Can we even open this? Lock from the other side. Well, we've been out there, so... It's not an issue. I don't need to go back out there again. We cleared this whole place. There is no loot left in here. Um, yeah, let's 
gonna be easier to go this way. Get A rank with Krauser, unlock Krauser by getting A rank with Lewis. Oh. See, that's that's what I'm worried about because I like using the melee. That's why I got S tier with uh with Wesker, because I meleeed like everything. But Lewis is apparently good with guns and whatnot, so I might have to try him. If we finish um OG Resident Evil early, I'll probably do some mercenaries, because that was a lot of fun try to get some more s tiers and i know there's there's higher than s tier there's like s plus and s plus plus apparently i don't know how many points you need to get those though punk has an instant kill next next snap hell yeah that sounds awesome okay open door use the envelope key now this should get us a cutscene. If I remember right, this was the cutscene where it's too dark to see anything. Lamp. If you get S plus with all characters on all levels, you unlock Leon's RPD outfit. That sounds awesome. And Krauser could turn into his mutant form? He literally runs runs into people and pulls out a piece of metal to hit with a... <laughs> That's funny. Why are you making those noises, Puka? Come on, buddy. All right, let's pick up this. If I remember right, this is the area where... Like, you get this stuff, and then... Like, you hear Rebecca scream in the distance. Oh, hell yeah. Switch here. No. So I guess that's not going to be an issue this time since we don't actually have Rebecca. I don't know why you're fretting, buddy. I don't know why you're fretting. Gosh dang cat. Okay. Should we go put the battery in? Fine with the shotgun. Puka! Come on! What? Just constantly. Come on, buddy. You know what we're doing. You know what we're doing. <laughs> A bonk or metal pipe sound effect? <laughs> He's also got dynamite, though. That sounds pretty great. All right. Um, should I dump some stuff first? No. No, I don't think I need to. I think we could just go out there and put the battery in. You get the better shotgun from uh, the Yawn fight. Because Yawn kills... Uh, what was his name? Richard? Like, super quick. So, you can just pick up the, the his shotgun like during that fight. Puka! You're killing me! Puka! What? Do it again. Meow again. Exactly. That's what I thought. Alright. Here we go. Yeah, we get it from the Yawn fight. The first Yawn fight. Yeah, yeah, no, we got it, like, right off the bat from Yawn. Oh, we need the crank. Shit. I didn't grab the crank. Uh, well, let's go put the battery in, and then we can grab the crank. Yeah, with Chris, we didn't get it till late game. Gotta go down this way. Anything fun in the residence? Uh, we get the wa the swagnum on the way to the residence. Uh, but honestly, it we cleared it super fast. This is where you first meet Lisa, and she smacks you in the face with her wooden hand.
Okay. Now we gotta put the battery in. The battery. That's not the battery. Battery should be there. This. And let's put this in. Let's see, that should take us back up. Yes. Now we gotta go grab the crank. I think it might actually be easier to go to the residence to get it. What is up? Game over. Long time no see. Uh, it might be easier just to run to the residence. Yeah. That's what I'm gonna do. Because we can run back into the house, but then we have to go upstairs, run around a bunch of stuff, go downstairs because of that door that doesn't have a knob. So I think I'm just going to go to the res residence. Not too much going on up there. I think there's a couple of zombies in the cemetery area, and then that one zombie in the path. That's about as far as it goes. Lisa's not there. She should be down in her hovel. So we shouldn't have to worry about her. I do love that they, when they go downstairs, they actually go down the stairs. That's a lot of fun. There's so many games that don't do that. I need to watch the the OG Resident Evil lines. <laughs> I'm not used to escorting men. Ridiculous. Oh, excuse you. Capcom was small time. Well, it was, what, 1996? 96, 97? That is a pretty terrible script, though. Terrible, hilarious. Alright, there should be a guy right there. There he is. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Almost a Jill sandwich. Yeah, it's happened a couple of times. Where I've gotten completely sandwiched in, uh, with zombies. There isn't any anything we need to do up here, though, so I'm just going to go up here and grab some stuff. Dump some stuff that we don't need. This is usually where we go where Lisa shows up the first time and beats us in the head. But uh, she should be down underground now. Uh, let's dump this. And we need the crank. Hookah. Hookah. Good lord. We're good on health. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Puka, do you want to be on the stream? Is that why you're whining so much? Like, do you know what's happening and you just, you want to be famous? Is that, is that it? I don't know what to do with this cat. Starts laughing at my scratcher, tells me to kill him. Chris, stop it. <laughs> I mean, that's, that is pretty on brand for Chris. You gotta wonder when he starts his boulder punching days, though. And I do wonder, like, how? How did he punch a boulder? Like, I... We never really talk about it. He straight up punches a boulder into a lake of lava. Like, how is he strong enough to do that? <laughs> Chris is laughing at the ultimate life form. Mom. That's funny. We know now that Wesker is not pathetic. Unfortunately, he becomes basically a god. But he does still get killed by Chris. Stupid zombies. That the famous composer for RE1 had a ghostwriter? The lies. The lies and deceit. How can you be a super famous composer and have a ghostwriter? was not, in fact, blind like his fame suggested. 
Wesker whooped Chris's ass in Code Veronica, so he bulked up on steroids in order to have a chance. <laughs> he got mad after I had to run from a boulder in RE1. Oh, that's funny. Maybe yeah, maybe he's got uh, maybe he's got boulder PTSD. PBSD. Post boulder stress disorder. So did the did, did the ghost writing composer like take over doing all the music for for Resident Evil then? Let's see. Let's we got to do the crank. Crank the thing. Open up the waterfall. Basement for RE1 OG. I love some of the music in the remake. Actually, I love most of the music in the remake. Especially... What am I doing? Especially the, uh, the save room music. Like, I can just sit and listen to that. What are you looking at, Kuka? I could almost go to bed to that that music. Okay. That's done. We don't have to worry about snakes anymore. We don't have to go back to the residence. The clown farts. What? There's a director's cut? How are there so many versions of the same game? Just ridiculous. Let's see, where's the... Did I go the wrong direction here? Well, yes. Yes, I did. Here we go. Now we go through the waterfall. Okay. Hold on. Before we continue, I gotta look this up. RE1 basement theme. I can't show it on stream because of probably copyright. So, let me look it up here. RE1 basement theme. Director's Cut DualShock OST Mansion Basement. So you think you know what? Oh, seriously? Did There's really? fucking ads on a one minute video? Come on, YouTube. First up, we've got Shake. Is this it? Kind of, I don't know. This is kind of cool. Oh, wait. So it specifically has to be the director's cut one? That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, that's some, like, Beethoven level, level composing right there. I mean, truly, truly Be Beethoven level. Oh, my God. Yeah, that just sounds like a bunch of clowns farting. That was ridiculous. So, to reiterate again, though, what do we do with this transparent creature swimming around in the water? Like, can we even do anything with that? Is it a thing? I'm curious about that. 
I'm so sad that I missed out on that. I'm gonna have to somehow find the director's cut just to just to play that portion. Cause that was incredible. See, there should be a storage box over there. It is. Store this. Right, three original had something called live decisions where you could make choices like fighting or running from nemesis. Some of them could change the ending. Again. That's actually pretty cool. I don't know why they didn't keep that in. I will take the ink ribbon. Thank you. And let's save just real quick. Because this area is fairly long. Transparent creature is nothing. Hmm. Live decisions in the game. That's that, that's actually pretty cool. Because <coughs> that that's um, I mean games do that nowadays, where your your choices affect the game. So having that in, I mean, when did Resident Evil Two come out? Was it like the nineties, late nineties, early two thousands, or Resident Evil Three? So having those kind of choices in a game that old, it wasn't really a thing, then. Oh, there's a green herb over there. 98? Yeah, so it wasn't really a thing then. So having something like that, like that's a really unique system that's been picked up by most game companies at this point. Okay, we need the square crank. I hate that the transparent creature is nothing. Like, why would they tell us about it and then it be nothing? Those, they tease. Oh, there's loot in all these tunnels. Let's see, what do we got? Acid shells and a boulder. Um, that boulder's gonna start moving here in a second, isn't it? Can we fight the tiger? Swag dumping a swagnum? I mean, you know I gotta do it. Like, I can't not swag dump a swag dump. Infinite ramrods and he went down in a minute. Yeah, I mean, makes sense with infinite ramrods. All right, there's the thing in here. I can't do anything with it yet because I have the green herb on me. Let's just use that. And I will take this. want stars I'll give you stars all right there's I know there's a ton of loot down here so it's it's gonna take a little while just to clear all the loot out um, let's see the spider should be soon should be theoretically I love you, Puka. Don't look at me in that tone of voice. All right. Is Here we that go. you, Jill? Is that voice Enrico's? Yeah. You're alive. Stop. Are you with anybody, Jill? No. What? This is but not the time why? to hit on me. <laughs> the stars are. Finished. We should go Someone to dinner. Is a traitor. Umbrella set us up. He didn't even react. It's just. Abrigo! And then he's done. He just goes. Ugh. Traitor. Cheesy one-liners. Yeah, you're not wrong. All right, so he's got the crank. Oh shit, I don't have enough on me to, enough room on me. Come on, um, shit. Well, <coughs> oh, I think I can, yeah. Let's see, let's use a couple of shotgun rounds. It's not the best thing to do, but I've got so much ammo. It's just so I can clear up a spot in my inventory. So we can pick up the crank. 
There we go. Okay, this area is done. Wesker is done shot the guy. Oh, Jesus! Blame it on Hollywood. I mean, that makes sense, yeah, because Hollywood in the 90s, like, it was one-liner city. You couldn't have an action movie in the 90s without having a one-liner. <laughs> that was so ridiculous. It literally just sounds like a room of clowns sitting on horns and or farting. I suppose if a clown farted, it would, it would sound like that, so... There's, oh, there's loot in this room somewhere, and I don't know... I feel like I had this issue last time. I couldn't find the loot that was in here. Maybe it has to do with something over here. Oh, this is going to piss me off. Yeah, I think that's what Game Over was saying, is they weren't, they, like, they were lying about being a composer. Plus, they weren't blind. There was a ghostwriter, like, a whole bunch of stuff. What's my favorite music in the Resident Evil series? Um, it's a tie between the save room music in 1 and Mr. X's theme in, uh, in 2. That music that comes on anytime he comes onto the screen is super cool. Right in the face! Why do you keep getting up? How many times have I got to teach you this lesson? All right, five rounds left on the shotgun. Should be just the one hunter. He's a very famous and renowned Japanese composer. Seriously? That made the clown farting? That's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Let's see. Can I dump? Let's dump these. I don't need them right now. And we got the crank. Use. Not necessary to use this now. Fuck you. Okay, there we go. I wasn't even near it. <laughs> Self-proclaimed blind, but later found out able to see. He also understood little of the music and had a ghostwriter. Leon Escape Team, Mr. X Final Battle. That was pretty good, too. I think I still prefer the Mr. X theme as he's, like, walking around. Because, like, there's the no music when you're walking around, and then there's the Mr. X theme when he shows up, and I really enjoy that. He was publicly shamed and his career died. Damn. Collapse, Last Judgment. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. I wish I could mix them inside storage. But you can't. Went the wrong direction. Here we go. <laughs> Collapse last judgment. Serenity from OG4 or Code Veronica save room theme. Okay, hold on. This is gonna be a weird stream because we're gonna we're gonna listen to some music. It's Resident Evil music, so it's it's on brand. All right, what was it? RE4 Serenity. X going give it to you. Oh no, that's for an hour. We don't want that. listen to the whole thing but uh, I like this that almost seems like it doesn't fit and code Veronica save room theme while well, all these are coming up like right off the bat like do people just look this stuff up oh ads come on YouTube me, you suffer in silence but Oh, I like that. I like this. I, I dig this, this save room. Yeah. 
I mean, the music is good. Okay, I like that one. And then what was the last one? Collapse, Last Judgment. Resident Evil. Let's do Last Judgment. Last Judgment. At Resident Evil 2 Remake, Collapse, Last Judgment. RE2 OG save theme? Okay. This is a five minute song? Oh. Oh, that's cool. Uh, the next game, Game Over, is uh, Evil Within. That's our next game. Probably starting tomorrow, to be honest. Oh, which means I gotta make a thumbnail. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Oh, I like this. Oh, that goes hard. Okay. Resident Evil 2. OG. Save room theme. What is up, Amit? You gotta head out? Sounds good, game over. Have a good day. Night. Night? Have a good night. Have uh I think it's night for you actually. Resident Evil 2 save room. Oh, these are so like serene. And I love it. I love how the save game or the save rooms are so like they do a good job of really conveying that it's that it's a safe room. That it's like that it's calming. Sounds like a police station to you? Interesting. Now, a lot of these remind me, I don't know if you guys have seen the Silent Hill movie. Hill, piano, piano theme. So a lot of the Resident Evil stuff sounds similar to, to this for me. Promise for prize. No, I think it's which one is it? Movie. Um, I think it's that one. At Fry's, ah! even quality of Kroger brand products will make you feel like you're winning. Yeah, that's a good point. That they they convey prices. that it's. It's temporary. Yeah, this. This is from the Silent Hill movie. I love it. Wait for it. Wait for it. It gets better. I think. What is this? Yeah, it's coming up. Here it is. Oh, I love that. Okay, Resident Evil 7 save room theme, and then we're gonna continue. Save room theme. This, this stream is just turning into listening to Resident Evil OSTs. Oh, I do love this one. I do love this one. It's got such a cool like like twist, like twang to it, and I love it. Yeah, it's so good. It's so good. I mean, it's no uh, Don't Tell Aunt Rhody, but it's good. It's good. Okay. Let's go. Here we go. Back to the game. What is up, Ahmed? I wonder what Tashar's at. I, I think he's, uh... He's probably still doing school. Okay, we need the flamethrower, which means we need to go kill the spider. I probably shouldn't have kept the... Oh, boy. <laughs> instrument reminds me of a Japanese instrument. Oh, shit! I forgot about the boulder! Oh, God! I hate to say it, but I think that might actually be my first death of the game in the Jill playthrough. That might be the first death in the Jill playthrough. Wow. 
Wow. I did not save after getting all that shit. Fucking boulder. How could I forget Don't Tell Aunt Rhody? Oh, song is so good. So good. Like, the... the 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 intro cinematic for Village, I think, is my favorite. But the song, Go Tell Aunt Rhody, is absolutely, like, goat for me. Uh, did we already pick up that plant? No. Which means we haven't cleared any of the areas. Ugh! There we go. If only Chris were here. Yeah, Chris could have saved us. He could have punched that boulder. Where is that boulder punching asshole? Got that. Um, I need to make room for the crank, so. Let's equip this. Don't judge me for using shotgun shells. It's fine. We've got ammo. I'll be fine. Can't go that way. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. I can't believe I died. It does, yeah. Oh, it's such a good song. I actually, I have that on my phone now. Like, I listen to that shit in the car. It's such a good song. There's got to be some loot somewhere. I know I'm, I didn't miss loot in this room. You're judging me for using shotgun shells? No. Don't. I need the room. Oh, come on. I don't know. No, I don't need to look at that. I need to pick up the acid routes. Yes. Because we got to pick up the crank. Wesker's going to shoot that guy, and we got to pick up the crank. I've probably heard that many times. Yeah. I get judged a lot for the stupid shit that I do. It happens. <laughs> Alright, where is that other item? There's still supposedly another item here. Yes. And also, don't judge me for using this green herb. <coughs> it's always good. I mean, yeah, she's hungry. Don't you judge me. Uh, do I need the elevator piece yet? I suppose I can get it on the way back. I'll just get it on the way back. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, here it is. Oh, I think we're gonna clear this room. Yes! I want to try and finish the game where there's no loot. That's my goal, is to finish the game with no no red areas. Puka, why you gotta look at me in that tone of voice? I love you, but is there something... Is there something behind me? Did you hear the clown farts? Is that what it was? He's traumatized. Is that all right? Get the crank. I think that's all there is in this room. Yeah. We can go get the elevator piece now. Oh Jesus! Fucker! Ah! Ouch! Oh, come on with the stagger! No! No! Oh! Right in the nuts! Right in your froggy nuts! Come on, stand up! Stand up! Or just be dead. First thing you hear is my life sucks. <laughs> yeah, we've talked about that before, yeah. Pro gamer. We've talked about that before. Like, imagine if there's there's a streamer that just kind of sits like this. Doesn't talk with chat at all. And just like, my love sucks. I don't want to, I don't want to do this. Fun fact, the voice actor for the OG Claire was the actor from the big comfy couch we all watched growing up. She was Claire all the way up until Revelations 2. Interesting. I gotta ask, what is the big comfy couch? Is that a show? Because remember, I'm an old fart. Oh, there goes YouTube's analytics are all fucked again. Big 
big comfy couch. Why does that sound kind of familiar? Okay, this room is cleared. Coolest weapon in Resident Evil. Coolest weapon in Resident Evil. That's a really tough question. That's a really tough question. Fucker! Fuck! No, 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 no. Why? Why am I just suddenly missing all these shots? What is this bullshit? Right in your froggy nuts. Uh, coolest weapon is in you. I don't know, man. That's a really tough question. I don't know. I mean, I, I, uh, probably the Swagnum. Definitely the Swagnum. And I think probably, uh, Village's Swagnum. Oh, the lightsaber. Well, I haven't gotten the lightsaber yet, so <clears throat> I haven't been able to experience the wonderfulness that is the lightsaber. What did I just do? Assault shotgun. Let's put those there. We don't need those yet. I think I don't need that yet. I do need the crank. Oh, yeah, the Albert was pretty great. You know what? Let's save. Because I did just die last time and we had to redo everything. So. <coughs> Let's save. Because I don't want to keep dying. Although, honestly, I could do an entire stream of just me dying. I've died so much in Resident Evil, it's not even funny. Not as much as, like, a Souls game, but I have died a lot to Resident Evil. Of course, Wesker says that. I mean, he's not wrong. He's not wrong. Speaking of uh, Dark Souls, Amit, how did it go last night with that boss? With, uh, what's her name? I can never remember her name. The poison chick. Hookah! Hookah! Why you keep doing that? Your ego is as big as the Spencer Mansion? Well, having beat Ethan Must Die, I mean, I can assume... I... I can... I... I What's the word I want to say? I understand. I get it. It makes sense that the ego would be so big. Puka, for Pete's sake! You're not going in that room. I'm not going to let you in that room. I'll grab this. Wesker was canonically in RE7? No, no, no. It's his, uh, his gun. The Wesker. I mean, the Albert from the final boss of RE7 was up there. Yeah, yeah. Myth of the Baneful Queen. That's that's what her name is. Puka! Come here. What do you want? You want treats? Of course you're going to whine so you get treats. No, I don't want to hear anything. After you get treats. Ah, this cat. I'll tell you what. There's a Tommy gun in four and a triple shotgun in five. Oh, the dual power fist. I forgot about the power fist. The okay. Yeah, the power fist is pretty fantastic. I do love the power fist. Killed her after getting killed twice. Nice, nice. The Chicago typewriter. That's your favorite weapon? Okay, uh, the boulder's gonna start moving. Uh, uh. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Go, 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 go. Ah! Nailed it. Pro gamer. Triple shotgun is called a Hydra? That sounds awesome. I did forget about the power fist. Oh, you're talking about, like, an actual gun? I thought you were talking about the typewriter being your favorite weapon in Resident Evil. I mean, honestly, it, it is a, a, a weapon, kind of, being that you're able to save with it, which makes us essentially immortal beings. All right, we got the shotgun shells. 
Oh, Chicago typewriter is the is the Tommy gun. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down. I would say I'm gonna amend what I said. I love the Swagnum, don't get me wrong, but uh, I'm gonna say Joe Baker's fists are my are my favorite weapon. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? I didn't bring any healing items at all. And it's dead. What a disappointing fight. Ouch. Let's see, there's... I think there's... There it is. I think that, I think that did it. Demon of Song? That sounds familiar. I will take the survival knife, thank you. Why does Demon of Song sound familiar? Um, there's nothing else in this room. Equip. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, no, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Fuck, 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 fuck. Why did I waste four grenade launcher rounds? Because I'm an idiot. <laughs> Dies in four hits. It died in two hits. It died in two hits. I don't remember the spider being really difficult last time either. Of course, we had the flamethrower thro for it, so... I don't know why we didn't get the flamethrower this time. But I mean, come on, Wesker. When was the last time I was smart when it came to this game? Other than when I did math yesterday. That was that was pretty smart of me. Hopefully there's a heal. Yay! Healing items! Hookah! What is with you? Bud! You're killing me! Yes, I will take that. Thank you. Take this. Yeah. Mods crush his skull. I like using the uh, the band hammer analogy. Bringing down the band hammer. I haven't actually had a band. Any well, no, there was one guy that showed up on a stream, I think two or three streams ago, that said some offensive shit, and I had to, I had to, to nuke him. That was about it, though. I haven't really had any issues. Okay, we got the map. Cleared out all the loot here. Uh, let's have that. Yeah, let's just equip the normal pistol. I have so much pistol ammo, it's not even funny. Okay, so I don't... It seems I don't need to use the flamethrower to get through these doors at all. Where's the next boulder? I know it's coming up. Uh, hmm. Use the crank. Yep. Yep. I think we can... I think we can trigger it. Somehow. Maybe not. Had to ban two guys in the same stream? Wow. Shit. I I, I find it... I think I, I, I count myself blessed that I haven't had to deal with that. Go, 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 go! Oh! Ah! Made it. Made it. Pro Gamer. Let's go. Okay, let's go down here. There is loot in this room. Ooh. I will take that, thank you. Examine. Maybe that's why I haven't had to use my healing items so much, because I haven't had, I haven't died. First death was today. Out of the entire game, the first death was today. How disappointing is that? 
I could have gone the whole game with no deaths. Demon of Song looks like a frog. Demon of Song. Oh, he's that dude. He, he pulls open his mouth and it reveals his face and you got to go punch him in the face with your giant sword. I guess it depends on on what weapon you're using. I usually go with, with big swords. Like, that's my go-to. Yeah, I remember that guy. That was actually a pretty easy fight. A lot of the bosses in, in, in 2 were fairly easy fights. Um... Yeah, that's true. And by an instant kill. Hookah! He's just... He's just in the distance, just whining. I don't know why. Pretty sure he just wants attention. Yeah, he's just sitting over there. Punch with sword. <laughs> Besides basement theme, what are the horrible Mario soundtracks? Yeah, I'm, I'm curious. Uh, let's see. We do need... And I don't need to know what kind of hole is there. I already know. What is up, Nano Machines? Code Veronica save theme. Um, I think we listened to that one, didn't we? Come on, here we go. Here we go. There we go. Now we're making progress. I mean, we're always down to listen to it again. I like the code Veronica save the oh, I guess I'm turning this way. Here we go. Yeah, I dug the code Veronica save. <laughs> Alright. We've got the statue in the correct orientation. We'll push it into the hole in the wall. Puka! Oh my god! What's got you so angry? <clears throat> Oh, look at that. First try. Look at that. What is this? This is for that elevator piece. Uh, God, I wish I could destroy items. Not a lot of bad. Show you Puka? Okay, hold on. Come here. Come here. Well, now you're being all weird. You want to whine that you want attention, but now you're being all weird when you want attention? All right, you, you'll come here for treats, won't you? Anybody who hasn't met Puka, here's the Puka. Now you're not gonna meow. You meow constantly while we're trying, what is up Kaboria, while we're trying to do the stream, but now he doesn't want to meow. Oh, he, he, he looks he looks angry. I'll let him eat his, his treats. Ah, uh, yes, I will take the cylinder. Thank you. Yo, Sapuka was a dog? Oh, he's he's got treats. He's got treats all day. I usually buy him a lot of treats. He's just whining because he wants attention. Or he... So my brother moved out. And, um, his room was always closed off, so Puka wasn't allowed at his room. <coughs> so now that he moved out, I'm still keeping that room closed because it still has a bunch of his shit in there. And, uh, Puka just he knows that, that my brother's gone, but he still wants to go into that room. And I don't let him go into that room, so now he, he sits in front of it and just whines. He's gonna go do it again. He's been on stream now, so... Puka is famous. Or as we call him in Arabic, Alwasha, which essentially means the beast. Oh, I'm out of Red Bull. That's sad. I'm going to have to go back to Costco. Man, we are burning through this. But we still got... Okay, so we've killed the spider. We still have Lisa's area. And then we still have um, the actual lab area. Oh my god, Puka! 
Bro. I'm gonna put you in the bathtub. It's not even a threat. He likes to hang out in the bathtub. He like sits behind. So there's the there's the shower curtain. You know how you have like a shower liner and a shower curtain. Puka will get into the bathtub and he will sit in between the wall of the bathtub and the shower liner and just kind of chill there. What a weird cat. Oh, oh, no. There we go. Oh man, trauma dumping to the camera. That would suck. I like to think that, that streams need to be happy. All streams should be happy, I think. I don't think there should be any kind of sadness in the stream at all. Unless the, the game is super depressing. But if the game is super depressing, I think that the streamer should be making making it a lighter stream, if that makes sense. Zaman. Why, yes, I will turn it, thank you. Yee. Turn it. There we go. Yes. Yes. Come on, we're almost there. Almost there. There we go. <coughs> oh, wait. It doesn't even... doesn't even stick like that. I don't know why I did that. Uh, we need to go put that back in the elevator. T-Virus cat. That's true, you know, in the entirety of the Resident Evil universe, we haven't seen any any infected cats. What all do I need? Do I need the crank anymore? I feel like maybe I should keep the crank on me, but I don't remember if I need to. I think there's a storage box coming up, if I remember right. So I shouldn't... I shouldn't need to. Yeah, I don't need it. I don't need it. But I do have to go back to the elevator room. Yeah, there's there there is the dogs. I I have not seen the infected ele elephants. I'm I'm curious what the elephants are like. I wonder if he's meowing at that door because maybe he thinks there's something behind it. This is freaking me out. This is freaking me out, man. Given him so many treats already, and he doesn't want to stop mewing. Outbreak files. That's what uh, that's what James was saying. Yeah. <coughs> okay. We have to look at which ones are first. So it's four, two, three, one. Four, two, three, one. There's empty space in the cylinder. We put that in. I can play code V. Yeah, I think it was... James had a good idea that we could... Uh, <coughs> before Resident Evil 9 comes out, we could go through and do the... Um, the non... Not necessarily non-canon, but the non-numbered Resident Evils. Like a, a full playthrough up to Resident Evil 9 coming out. But I think we should also do a, a replay of Village before 9 comes out. Alright, elevator's done. I probably should have brought some kind of healing item with me. The spin-offs, yeah. Jill. Barry? Thank God you're safe. Barry! You too, Jill. A noise I heard brought me down here, but I didn't expect to find a place like this. That's because you are uninitiated, you any Barry. Ideas to what might be at Let the bottom? me be your guide There's to the There's only one mansion. way to find out. Oh my god, even in the remake, the the dialogue is super cheesy. There's only one way to find out. I don't know how I feel about the open world what thing. What the hell is that sound? It could be a person. Mm. <laughs> Jill, go check it out. It could be a we person. We have surprises for one day. I'll stay here and secure our escape route in case something happens. Okay. You could buy the RE7 Swagnum? I didn't like the look of the RE7 Swagnum as much. I prefer the look of the uh, the village Swagnum. Alright, there be loot in this room. 
No, I didn't I'll want to. Stay and secure uh, our escape route. I'm aware. Thanks, bud. Thought you were standing on loot. That's the only reason I came to talk to you. Pile of sandbags. Okay. Uh, what am I going to need here? Um, I don't think I really need anything. But I know there's loot somewhere in here. I, or was this the room that I couldn't find all the loot in on the last playthrough? On the Chris playthrough. Because I know there's... Shit. Oh, Resident Evil, you're killing me. You're killing me. Let's try just going this way. Oh, it may not be the exact model. Oh my god, camera. There we go. There we go. There we go. Is that... Are we in the... Yeah, we're in the Lisa room. Uh, let's see. Where's she at? There she is. There she is. Behind and up to the left? I'll have to check when we go back to that room. Yes, I will take that. Let's combine these. Puka, you're not going in that room. Come on, bud. Alien versus Predator survival horror with a Predator stalker and an alien stalker. If they see each other, they fight. That would be interesting. And you're just kind of the human stuck in the middle. That'd be really interesting. Yeah, he's just sitting at that door looking at me. He just wants to go in that room. Uh, I know there's an area where we can climb up on the... On the containers and get loot. I think it might be this area. Maybe. But this is where we get the broken flamethrower to go through that door. Okay, that's done. Hit this. We're making progress. Ooh, we're at two likes already. Hell yeah. Let's go. 32 views, too. Hell yeah. My mom is texting me. My mom just got a new car. I'm a little jealous. I love my car, but there's nothing like a nice new car. Yeah, so we get a, uh, a broken flamethrower to open the door. Swagnum bullets! I'm gonna save that swagnum for, uh, for the tyrant. Dude, I have so many pistol bullets, it's not even funny. I've barely used this gun. I have almost 300 pistol rounds. Come on. Come on, Jill. Let's go. Alright, we go back. A melee a trois? Melee a trois. I think it would be an interesting horror game because, like, the humans, while being somewhat of a threat, aren't that much of a- oh, that's Lisa. Aren't that much of a threat. Especially during a- it would have to be multiple aliens. Yeah, we need the broken flamethrower. Yeah, it would have to be multiple aliens. Or, like, the, uh, the queen alien. You know, from Aliens? I don't know, Nikolai from from RE3 was bear what the fuck, Barry? What a dick. Oh yeah, that's why I'm playing with controller. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna fuck around with with uh with keyboard and mouse on this game. Where is the loot in this room? Like it doesn't do that glint like other loot loot does. And I can't remember if it's up here or if it's if it's like 
If it's down, if, once you have to go down the ladder. I wonder if it's down there. There was a horror game, Alien vs. Predator, and it's really good. There's a human campaign, Alien campaign, Predator campaign. Oh, I remember that. <laughs> it's like Dave, Steve. My name is Billy Bob. Uh, should I grab the swagdom? You know what? Yeah, yeah, I think I'm gonna grab the swagnum. I'm grabbing it. Combine that. There we go. There we go. Wait a second. Holy shit, how far behind is the stream? What did you guys just see happen? Okay, so you've seen Barry go up and out. Right? Did I just go down a ladder for you? Because on my little preview, it shows us like super far behind. Yeah, my little preview is like six minutes behind where the actual stream is. Come on, YouTube. Just ridiculous. YouTube's live statistics are are super weird. Yeah, so it looks like the stream is good, but my little little preview window is is fucked. It's like six to eight minutes behind. That's weird. I don't know why that happens. We'll see it in six minutes. <laughs> yeah, just you just wait till you see what happened six minutes from now. It's ridiculous. Okay, we've got the broken flamethrower. Let's go down, grab it. Why, yes. Thank you. Go up here. Still says there's loot here, but I don't know where. Some old supplies are labeled waste materials. What the fuck? I know, Barry just straight up fucking leaves. I can't believe it. Where the hell is this loot? Oh, I really don't want to leave this room not looted. We might have to, though. Like, if I can't find it... Fuck. I think there's a handgun magazine. Yeah, I think that's what it is, too, but I can't remember where it is. Because it, like, blends in with the environment. Up the ladder. It's not over here. No way back. Barry, why? Barry left us to die. He left us! What is up, Baytok? Adrian Vaughn, DC. Can I just call you Adrian? Oh, it's on a box? I mean, we... We hit all the boxes pretty hard. Yeah, it's not... It's not letting me... Oh, it's right there! Right there! Come on! Let's go! Right in front of me. Did I get it? Yes! Pro Gamer, let's go! Uh, I've got too much ammo in that one stack. I can't even use it. Okay, so the flamethrower we put up. It does that. You do sound like a musical composer. It's a very, very proper name. I love it. But welcome to the chat. Welcome to the stream. It's not that scary of a game. It's pretty. Uh, there's some jump scares. There's definitely some jump scares. Oh, 
I would, uh, I, I hope the channel gets big someday too. Thank you very much for that. And for the sub. Oh, jeez. Uh, I gotta go to that door. Come on, Lisa. I know, right? Like, they put that loot on the ground and it just, it doesn't glint or anything and they, it just, like, blends in with the floor. That's true. Fear is subjective. Fear is subjective. Subjective. That's true. I think, I think we've been desensitized by, uh, Oh, shit, I gotta hit the lever. We've been desensitized by other horror games. Oh, Jesus! Fucking A! Oh, Lisa got me. Lisa got me. Whew. I think I might have a heart attack. Oh, oh my God. Do you mind if I call you Adrian? Because I feel like I might mispronounce Baytalk. Batok? Baytalk? Yeah, yeah, I gotta flip the switch. Uh, I'm gonna have a heart attack because she she smacked me in the face with her wooden hands. Fuck you, Lisa. Where's the switch? There's the switch. And it's a timed switch, too. So we gotta go here. Uh, yes, going the right way. Use the broken flint. Come on, we gotta focus. I gotta like stand right in front of it. There we go. Ludwig van Beethoven. That's a good point. It does show how scary zombies can be. Because everybody thinks like I'd survive the zombie apocalypse. And then no, you pro oh, I fucking hate this area. You probably wouldn't survive the zombie apocalypse, to be honest. Let's eat this. Yeah, I just don't want to mispronounce your name, so we'll just, I'll say Adrian. But yeah, welcome to the chat. Welcome to the channel, man. Uh, where's the jewelry box? Jewelry box. Oh, oh there's snakes. There's snakes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, and we're good. Let's see, where is her jewelry box? Bed is still warm. There's a dagger. Bunch of photographs featuring a young girl. Hookah! You're not going in there! Alright. Starting to think maybe something's wrong with it. And we get the stone ring and a picture. This is the, like, notes about them getting tested on, and it's um, Lisa's like diary about how she's essentially wearing so Puka! You're not going in that room. What's with you? What is with you? Thank you for the support. Uh Honestly, I hated the camera at first, but you get really used to it really quickly. Like it's it's um I don't want well, I guess you wouldn't get really used to it, but yeah, you do quickly get used to it. I think the last loot in this area is up above. Yes, here we go. Pick that up. Well, yes, I will take that, thank you. Pick this up, and I think this should clear this area out. No, don't examine, combine. Okay, and that's all the loot for this area. Let's go. Fucking pro gamer, let's go. We've had quite a few new people in chat recently. Adrian, you're new. Uh, we had, um, what was their name last night? I can't remember off the top of my head. They commented on one of the videos. Ooh, we're up to 173. Thank you so much for that sub. Uh, Raphael, there it is. Regenerator from... Oh, what the fuck? 
And we are back in the residence. Um, am I going to need anything? I need metal object that goes combined with this. And I need uh, the other one of these, which is in that hallway. So let's look at the map. Once we get into the house, we go into that hallway, grab that, come through, save, and then we'll go hit the main hall. We're like on the end stretch here. Uh, do I need to keep it on me? Yeah, fuck it, I'll keep it. No, I don't need to keep it on. Yeah, no, there's no, there's no loot in between here and there. We've cleared everything out. Oh my god. So yeah, Adrian, the, the, the camera does freak out sometimes, but um, it's not that bad. It's it's much better in like third person and stuff, but the the fixed camera is really not that bad. You get you get used to it pretty quickly. Pretty quickly. It makes combat a little weird sometimes, though. A lot of times the enemy that you're shooting at is like off screen, so it's hard to actually shoot the enemy. Oop. Excuse you, sir. Stupid zombies. Oh, shit. Stupid zombies. Biggest choice for best end soon. Oh, no. Yeah, no, it. I can definitely see that, that it would freak you out if when you don't see, uh... When you don't see the enemy. So, really the only ones that I've had to deal with off of screen have been the dogs. And sometimes the crows, but really it's the dogs. Zombies are generally on screen. The hunters I haven't had any issues with. It's it's mostly just the dogs that uh, that stay off screen. And they're the most annoying, to be honest. Because I think we're going to be dealing with some dogs when we get back to the courtyard here in a second. If I remember correctly. Man, we have just burned through this game. just gonna sit there mewing I wonder what it would be like in first person that'd be interesting it'd be cool to see the mansion in first person I think I shouldn't have looked at him I looked at him now he knows that I know he's there and now he's just gonna keep meowing oh they will remake this again so are you playing the the remake version, Adrian? Or, or are you just playing, like, the OG? Like, original Resident Evil. Because the remake, I think, is a lot a lot better. You get the better frame rate. You get the better looking everything. Yeah, he's... Mew, mew, mew. He's laying on the floor now, kind of like this. And he's, like, stretching his paws underneath the door to the room that he's not allowed to go in. I get that cat. I'll tell you what. That fucking cat. Uh, I feel like I should put the medallions in first. Or should I save first? Let's save first. I'm going to save. Just in case the worst happens. Biggest choice for the best end. What is the biggest choice for the best end? We've already beat the game, so we know what, what happens. So what is what is this choice? Just the remake, my brother played the OG and saw his heart. Oh yeah, no. You're you are absolutely correct there. You just saw like some of the pain in the ass situations there we had with with items. Um sometimes it's rather annoying to Doing a motion with your chin to strengthen the jaw bones? What is... What is that? Me... Me... I don't... I, I don't know what you mean! <laughs> I... I feel like I just made myself look like an idiot. But, I mean... I do that a lot, to be honest. To be fair, 
I, I consistently make myself look like an idiot. Dude, we have saved so much less as Jill than we did with Chris. I think I might be able to do this game in like less than 15 saves, I think it is. But there's also an achievement for doing it in no saves, which I don't know if I could do that. You have to start the whole game again. But yeah, Adrian, you are 100% correct. There's a lot of situations where you go to like try to clear a room and there's there's an item you just can't find. don't know what mewing is it's a way to hold your jaw that apparently is good for your jaw look at that okay i'm gonna i'm gonna look up mewing mewing is this what is this what is this i don't get this there's no videos or anything, so it's just, I mean, yeah, that, that definitely does happen uh, quite a bit, Adrian. But luckily on this playthrough, we've cleared every room. So far, we have not found a room that we have not been able to loot, and it's been going really well. Mewing. Mewing. I don't know. It's where you wear a cosplay of the Pokemon Mew. I can what? You're not going in that room. We've had this conversation before. I'm making a fool of my fels myself. It happens. It happens. But if you can't laugh at yourself, ah oh, shit! Fuck you! If you can't laugh at yourself, life's just gonna be really boring. You know, you gotta be able to have fun gotta be able to have fun in life all right go through here i don't think i'd cosplay as mew i would prefer to cosplay as probably like maybe machamp or magikarp i'd do a magikarp well luckily i keep all the vods so you can always watch them but it is, I think it is always best live. Oh, come on. You gotta like focus specifically on it. There we go. We got one of them. I actually don't know how, like, how discoverable I am on YouTube. Wonder what's on the other side of the door. Well, it sounds like Lisa's on the other side of the door. I don't even know like how discoverable live channels are on YouTube. I know Twitch is really big for that because they like they have a giant wall of games that you can select from. Um but I don't know actually how like discoverable people are on on streams. Uh I don't think I need anything. I think I'm fairly good actually. Uh, I'm gonna dump the grenade launcher. I don't need it right now. Or should I dump the pistol? I'm not even using it, really. I'm gonna dump the pistol. There are a couple of zombies coming up, though, that maybe... I wonder if I could use the acid on the zombies? I wonder what that would do. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. That's a good point. Walking Dead Destinies? I've never heard of that. Did I miss the typewriter? I might have missed the typewriter. I don't think I need to save. I'm good. We saved before coming here, so we should be fine. Should be fine. I've never even heard of it. I didn't even know it was a game. I, I know about the Telltale Walking Dead games, but... I didn't know there was like other games other than the Telltale ones. We have another room that might have some tough loot here. Uh, I don't remember if the loot 
is up here or if it's down below. I think it might be down below. There are knife only runs of this game. That's impressive. That's very impressive. Jill, you're alive. I was worried because I thought you were. <laughs> oh shit! Start talking. Barry's bad. Calm down. I didn't want to do it. Believe me, I can explain. Don't lie to me. Wait. Oh, Lisa. Ah! I didn't know Barry was bad. Ah! Oh! No time to talk. Jill, hand me my gun. Uh. Um. What should I do? Chat, what should I do? I don't know what to do here. I f he's bad, so I feel like I should not give him his gun back. But, I don't know. Yes? Alright. Thanks, Jill. Let's see. Just go ahead and do this. Oh, uh, can I get? I can't. Whoa, excuse me. Feed him to Lisa. <laughs> Feed him to Lisa. <laughs> what is up, Simple Jack? Come on, come on, do the thing. Here we go. Play the basement theme again. All right. We'll play the basement theme while we're fighting Lisa. Resident Evil. Evil director's cut mansion basement theme. Do you for your whole oh, fucking ads. It actually works. Fucking ads. It? Native combines the best of nature with the best. I mean, I we don't even need to kill Lisa. We just push this down. She does the thing. <laughs> this fucking song. This fucking song. It completely trivializes this this scene. Because this is actually a really dark and depressing scene. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. It's so ridiculous. That is just absolutely ridiculous. I can't believe we did that. <laughs> oh my god. So, okay. Uh, Adrian. To explain a little bit, we did kind of just trivialize that scene. But... So, Lisa, basically, you can do the fight. Um, yes, I am very disappointed in this fight. It, it should have been it should have been a better fight. Uh, but basically, with this fight, she the whole thing about Lisa is is she's been infected and and changed and morphed and mutated and everything. And then there's um, she finds like, she finds a fake mother and then she kills the fake mother cuts off her face and puts it on her own face and then you can actually fight her in this fight or you can just open up the sarcophagus and she grabs her mother's head and essentially just commits suicide so can i even say that word puka you're not going in that room it's actually a really dark scene i don't know what happened to barry uh let's see just that's that's the mother stuff yeah it is lisa's got a really tragic backstory um i don't think there's any loot in here wait did we read that last time 
Uh, crumple memo. I don't think I read that. No, I did. What is up, Miracle Sled Dog Team? Oh, yeah, I think we're up to 10 right now, actually. That's true. So apparently she is not dead yet. Can we call you uh, Miracle? Welcome to the chat and the channel. And the stream. Okay, so we need those two metal things. Uh, so I need to go back and grab those. Yeah. Well, what is up, Miracle? If Barry dies, bad ending is the forbidden thing on Discord at everyone. I didn't know that. That's interesting. I mean, I'm not that knowledgeable in this game. Luckily, everybody here in chat is very knowledgeable about this game. So that definitely helps a lot. Um, but I did play through a lot of it and beat it as Chris. And we spent a lot of time in the game. So there's... We, like, we read all of the documents and everything. This is more of a speed run with Jill. Um, but as if you watch the Chris playthrough, we did actually read everything. I should probably talk to Barry. So I you get you get all that really lore and, and background. Leave this place up to me. And go on ahead. Okay. What a fucking twat. Leaves us with the elevator and everything. I liked Barry. I don't get it. That doesn't make any sense. All right, let's go to the storage box. Oh, yeah, you're all good. You are all good, Adrian. Oh, oh, here we go. Wow, we've got a bunch of new people in chat today. Got a bunch of OGs, bunch of new people. This is great. I'm having a good time. Morning streams should be happening more often, I think. Hookah. No. Okay. Oh, let's see. Berries and Revelations? Oh, man. I'm going to have to play Revelations then. Best ending path. Let's go. Uh, Wesker? Yeah, I'd put you as an OG. I think the og -est OG is game over. Because he was way back from the... Uh, way back from the Dragon's Dogma streams. And James has been here for most of them. Pretty much all of them. Um, I think I should save and I need the metal eagle and metal wolf. How am I doing on health? Uh, Yeshi's been here for a long time. James has been here for a long time. Ben's been here for a long time. Uh, Squishy is new. Trev has been here for a long time. You would know him as Speedy. Um, honestly, there's quite a few OGs. Yeah, for me, it is 10.33 uh, a.m. Um, I wonder... I think there are zombies coming up. But I love that we're getting more people in chat. I love it. I think a, a good bumping chat... I said, I've said it once, I'll say it again. I think a, a good bumping chat makes the experience better for everybody. As me and Wesker joke... It's always good to have a good, like, animated stream versus the guy that's just kind of sitting there and seems very sad about his life and not talking and uh, doesn't react to chat, anything like that. The channel is growing. We're up to 173. Um, it blows my mind that 173 people tune into my pr particular brand of bullshit. And it just... It's 11.34 p.m. or a.m.? But yeah, it absolutely blows my mind that, that people actually really enjoy it. Because I definitely try. I, you know, I, I've, I've, I've watched some streamers and stuff like that. So I try not to base too much off of other streamers. But I try to make it an enjoyable time. Puka, stop it. You're not going in that room. I'm starting to get on my nerves now. Oh, nice. So you're only an hour ahead, Miracle. That's true. You did get not a hero within within an hour. Was that so? What difficulty was that on, uh, Wesker? 
Let's see, which one is this? Uh, wolf shape emblem. Use the wolf. There we go. This is the eagle. Use this. Or it's like a phoenix or something. I don't know if it's an eagle. Let's fucking go, Wesker. Wait, it is 12.34 p.m. for you, Resident is Evil? Hot damn. I almost want to let him in that van. No. 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 Meow. I don't know what to do about this cat. Don't know what to do about this cat. Thank you, Stream Elements, for finally showing up. Yes, I do have a Discord if you would like to join the Discord. We do talk quite a bit on the Discord. We all chat, talk to each other, share pictures, fun stuff, achievements, and whatnot. There is still stuff in End of Zoe, yeah. I wonder if, if you can speedrun end of Zoe, like how quick you can do it. Is there loot in this room? There is not loot in this room. Lots of awesome unlocks, hell yeah. I don't know what's gotten into him. Last night he was perfectly fine. Today he's just, he's just mewing. That's what she sound like. You're just angry. He's an old cat. Maybe he's just kind of doing his thing. Ah, uh, let's see. No loot in this room. I should save just so I'm in this area. Yeah. I don't want to use too many saves, though. I, I want it. My ultimate goal is to get this in less saves than we had with Chris. I think with Chris, we maxed out at like 36 saves. So if I can get it in under 36, I'm happy. Ink ribbon. There are zombies here, but I don't think there's a lot of them. So I should be okay. Spirit Blade? What is Spirit Blade? That sounds awesome. Yeah, I hear zombie. I wonder... <laughs> what? What? Uh, yeah. Does the acid do anything to the zombies? I could hold 12 in that gun? I could have held 12 this entire time? Uh, is he gonna come back as, uh, as Crimson? I wonder. I blew his leg off, so... I wouldn't think he'd come back as Crimson. That's pretty awesome that it's got lifesteal. Oh, uh, I wonder if he's going to come back as Crimson. Okay, we got the MO disc. Whoop, whoop. Excuse you, sir. Excuse you! Um, let's see if I can blow his head off. Because I don't want to have to burn him. Boom! First try, let's go! Pro gamer! Holds as many as you got in the launcher. Okay, that's that's pretty dope. Then we can make a super herb out of all of these. Let's fucking go. This Jill playthrough has been so smooth. Except for that one death we don't need to talk about. Combine. And we can't get through that door. So let's go down here. There's a bunch of backtracking and running around we've got to do here. 996 acid rounds in one launcher? That would be kind of ridiculous. Okay, I know there's a zombie. Oh, what? Why didn't it blow his head off? Oh, that is some bullshit. Where's the other one? Where's he at? 
Oh shit! Shit 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 shit! I got too close. I got too close. Uh, I need him to get up. Is he gonna get up? Yeah, there he is. Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> is he dead? Is he fully... I know it's a waste of rounds, but... I gotta make sure he's dead. Gotta make sure he's dead. I will take the dagger, thank you. Now it's luck based? Yeah, I, I, I thought it was gonna be guaranteed. Like, it, it almost seems to be every time I do it, so... Locks, symbol resembling power area, okay. I remember this area well. We spent a lot of time here. You know, that's a good point. I don't remember, like, Leon or Chris or anybody like that getting uh, grenade launchers. All right, I want to take the magnum rounds. Yes, I will take the swagnum rounds. Let's go. Oh, uh, I remember this room having loot that we could not get. Shit. Ethan Winters and Chris in five. Chris gets a grenade launcher? Maybe I didn't use it as much. So, there is supposedly some loot in here that we could not get. Chris does have boulder punching abilities. You are correct, Adrian. As said in Resident Evil Village, that boulder punching asshole. I love that even in the in the Resident Evil universe, he is known for punching boulders. Okay, so we got one of the loots on the shelf. And there's... So, I don't want to spend a bunch of time in this room, but... we There was one that we didn't get through Chris's playthrough. And it, it bugged me. It always bugged me. I think we've basically cleared out that, cleared out that shelf, so... Ethan isn't trans. Ethan is mold. Yeah, it's like... Okay. This doesn't make any sense. Because we've hit pretty much everything. Except the computer. Which I wonder... I wonder if I can do that... If I can do this without doing that puzzle. Ah! Uh. <laughs> Wes the Wesker fight is I love it. I can't believe I got in without having to do that puzzle. Okay, so there's two things on the shelf. Um Oh! Oh, we got it! We got it! Fuck, finally. I might be able to clear out this room. Pro Gamer, let's go. Thank you, Resident is Evil. Let's go. Why, yes, I will take that. Thank you. Why, I don't need to keep looking at it. Oh, my God. Use. There we go. Oh. Oh, finally. We might be able to clear every room in the game. May be able to clear every room in the game. Okay. Oh, John. And Ada. So we got that done. Uh, what do we do? Um, basement door, operation slug floor. We found that by luck? Damn. Okay, that's done. 2F. Trying to enter the password. Um, cell. Permission granted. Boom. Oh, I'm so glad I remembered those passwords. That's great. 
And we'll quit. All right. So we did not have to go through and do that puzzle again. Just get through those done. Um, I mean, we can go into that room where the puzzle is because I think there's loot in there, but we don't actually have to do the loot. Like you found the, the passwords by luck? Okay. There's loot in here, apparently. But where is that? What loot be in this room? I don't see anything. Did I just go through the wrong door? I may have just gone through the wrong door. Oh, oh, oh. Well, she ends this world. This game. Jill is our guide to the end of the world. Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay. Mix of two green herbs. Oh, we got healing items for days. And that's everything in this room. This should be the x-ray room. I don't... I don't remember if there's any, like, actual loot in here. Other than, than the x-rays and lore. So, oh, there might be something. Catches your attention. Okay. Put up the x-ray. I wonder if these count as, like, loot or not. So let's just put them up. Just in case. Just in case. Because I want I don't want any red rooms. At all. At all. Oh, man. We should have messaged Greg. Uh, okay. Need this. This is... This should be done. That's where we get the password for the next room, and there's no more loot. We're good. Those are Chris Fed Chris Redfield's x-rays. Man, he's fucked up. Because he's got a bunch of different names on him. Uh, where am I going? What room is this? Should I be in here? Oh, at least there's stuff in here. I'm going to use this just so I have room. Oh, there's a bunch of loot in here. <laughs> Pro Gamer! Every time you chat, it pauses the stream? Shit, I didn't know that. Is that a, is that a thing? Like a normal thing that happens, or? That's weird. That's really weird. Uh, yes, I do have a mo disc. Thank you. Wait a second. Did we get the other mo disc? It does when you're watching videos too. Weird. That's strange. Um, where's the third Mo disc? I don't remember where the third Mo disc is. Oh shit! Where is it? Well, we had to have found it because we cleared all the loot out of um. We cleared all the loot out of the mansion, so we have to have the Mo disc. Like, it's impossible for us not to have the mo disc. And what the hell loot is in this room? Oh, no loot left behind, Puka. No loot left behind. Oh, he's crimson. He's crimson. Do the crimson come back? Oh, he ain't coming back from that. He is definitely not coming back from that. It says there's loot in here. Of course it's pistol ammo. Oh, we're going to have to go store some stuff before we do that. Locked, symbol resembling a power area. And I think this one's locked too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I... 
I'm, I'm gonna save at least six rounds of the Swagnum for the uh, the Tyrant, but yeah, I'm gonna have some fun with it. Swagnum is my favorite gun, so I'm gonna have I'm gonna have some fun with it. Everybody always saves like the best guns for the end, but then you end up at the end with like 12 Swagnum shots because you never used them. So I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna have some fun with it. We're gonna do some dirty with the uh, with the Swagnum. Oh Jesus! Woo! And that's why we use the swag. Pro gamer. Oh, uh, let's see. I gotta go upstairs. Upstairs. We're gonna dump some stuff off. I don't think I need the... Do I need the incendiary rounds? Were those incendiary rounds that I picked up? Yeah. I mean, what is the tyrant weak to? I think we used the swagnum on him last time, so... We can dump the shotgun because we're out of shotgun ammo. I said that weird. Ammo. Can I go through this door? Why, yes. Yes, I can. I know there's going to be loot in here, too. That sucks that it pauses the screen whenever you message. That's really strange. Oh, there's the third ammo disc right there. Okay. Uh, and then there's a healing item. Shotgun shells. Uh, let's watch the thing real quick. Cerberus. Neptune. Oh. Sharks freak me out, man. The Hunter. The Tyrant. Alright. We done, we, we done did that. Oh, we can change out the, the thing, actually. I can pick up some loot. Let's do this. Use that. And it's the code at the end. 8462. 8462. 8462. 8462. Eight, 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 yes. 8462. Eight, Nailed it. Let's go. You don't have your own? Like, just haven't made one, or... Never got around to it. Well, either way, man. Thank you for the uh, the sub. Okay, that's that key that we need. Some sort of enemy. Oh, I can finally view the Kenneth film. Let's go ahead and watch it. Let's watch it. Oh, just haven't made one. Well, you are still absolutely welcome, even if it is your mom's channel. Ooh, up to six likes. Let's go. Um, I think I just picked up the third MO disc. Yeah. I don't think we put it in over here, though. Well, thank you. I think I'm a pretty interesting fella. Or I'd like to think so, at least. Mm, we got stuff to pick up in here, so. Let's go back to the storage box. Store some stuff. Usually it's the hat. I think it's the hat that draws people in. <laughs> it, the hat draws people in and then they come watch the stream and then they realize, wow, this guy is um, really boring. So we're gonna go to the st storage box. We're gonna dump a bunch of stuff in the storage box, go clear out that room of loot. Hopefully, uh, get the MO discs done. Yeah, there's definitely some first aid spray on the table. But I unfortunately have no room in my inventory, so... Gotta do that first. Make some room. Okay, we've got... Yeah, we've got the other two MO discs. So, I'm gonna store it real quick. Yeah, I've read that, like, um... How do I want to put it? Like, like the more people that are, that are on a stream, the uh, the more incentivized other people are to click on that stream. One shots the tyrant first battle. If you don't give Barry his magnum, you keep it, and it one shots the tyrant. Interesting. Well, 
now I'm kind of sad that I gave him his swag gun because I could have used that swag gun. It also, though, my reporting is way off again. Now it says there's six. We were at ten. Like, I don't even know what's going on. But force is the bad end. Lisa, Jack Baker, Mr. X all stalking in the Spencer Mansion. What would you do? Ooh, that's a tough question. Well run, for one. Jack we can kill. So kill Jack. Uh, Mr. X we can't kill. Yet. Oh no, there's still loot in here? Where is there still loot? Where Where is the loot? What loot is still in here? Sure, we need more protector. Lure them in to fight each other? <laughs> Don't mainly click on streams, but there's eight people. Maybe I'd find you interesting on plus bigger streams. In bigger streams, yeah, you never get noticed. That makes sense. A lot of people have mentioned that, you know, a lot of some people have come by and watched the stream because there is a lot of chat interaction. Um, I love interacting with chat, so that's that's one of the main reasons I do this. Map and laboratory ticket. Is that it? I do fear though that if I, I get bigger, it's going to be harder to to chat with people. What the fuck? Number one basement one. All right, we've cleared that room. Let's go. Let's go. But so far, that hasn't been an issue that I haven't been able to chat with everybody because it moves too fast or something like that. But I've seen, like, like you look at, like, Asmongold's chat or or any other bigger streamer's chat, and it's just, like, shoo, shoo, shoo. Just, just constant, constant messages. I'm terrified of what would happen if that would happen, like... How would I talk to people? At that point, I'd have to talk to myself, and I'm not great at talking to myself. Okay, let's, well, we don't need to store those. Let's combine these with the shotgun. We can store the first aid spray, because I don't need that. Boom, there we go. Yes, yep, Adrian, Lisa is the, is tragically the daughter of, of the guy that created the mansion that designed and built the mansion and then his wife he was killed his wife was tested on with the t virus and lisa was tested on with the t virus um and if i remember right his wife didn't have a reaction so she was also disposed of and but lisa had a reaction swagnum fuck yes and built the baker house yeah yeah, yeah that's right a good day what a good stream day what is this item here that i missed Where are you? It's, it's it's pistol ammo isn't it yeah is that it that is it all right okay let's go use the lab key yeah it's a super tragic story it resident evil so these streams are the first time I'm down for some mercenaries after we're done um, these streams are the first time that I've ever played Resident Evil Mi Miracle and actually I can I, I attribute um, the subs on the channel to getting me into Resident Evil because I did a poll on which game to play next and somebody had mentioned that you know I should try Resident Evil 4 Remake so I put that on the poll on the community page in the channel. And, um, where is it? Ow, shit. Little fucker. God dang it. This is why it sucks when they're off screen. There we go. So yeah, I did a, a, a poll on the channel on what to play next. And Resident Evil 4 Remake was like the overwhelming winner on the poll. So that, I mean, kind of started history, like... I started playing this game and fell in love with Resident Evils. We had a brief break with uh, with Dead Space, but um, it's pretty much been Resident Evil since then. 
little fucker. Oh, uh, let's see. There's not much to do in this room. Go through here. And you go down here. I can't push that. Would I visit Resident Evil Remake? I mean, we're going to visit it today when we do Mercenaries, so... But, like, like replay the game? Maybe. Definitely maybe. I know there's a way to get to the... Uh, I'm keeping the broken shotgun in there because I can't actually get rid of it. So there's a... There's a trap in the main house that especially you do as Chris and um, that's how you get the first shotgun oh as in replay the main, ca main campaign I mean yeah at some point I'd, I'd like to replay it it was a super good campaign so I, I'd definitely replay it and it would go quicker since uh, you know we've already played it and beat it um, what was I saying so yeah that's where you get the regular shotgun oh shit I didn't bring the MO disc and as Chris, you have to do it with the broken shotgun or else you get trapped in that room and killed. So as long as you have the broken shotgun, you can put it in the little trap on the wall and it doesn't kill you. But um, if you do it as Jill, you don't need the broken shotgun and you can just j go through and uh, Barry saves you. But... Since I'm trying to loot every uh, every room, I picked it up and put it in storage. It was a long explanation for I couldn't get rid of it, so I it in storage. Yeah, Silent Hill is definitely OG. I wish I could play the the originals, but uh, you do need an emulator to to do it. Oh, I need the MO disc. Um, I should go grab that. What is this? Where does this go? I know where the... I think I know where the third one is. Oh, we got a save room and a storage box. Hell yes. Hell yeah. Yes, I will take that. Thank you. Um, Let's store the first aid spray. God, I have so many healing items. It's just... It's just not even funny. And so much ammo. Um, let's see. I need the other MO disc. What am I doing? I should save. Save. Uh, yes. I did watch that. And it was absolutely ridiculous. I think, um... Who sent it to me? It was somebody on chat that told me about it. And we... And I, and I watched it. <laughs> Just ridiculous. Yeah, that's how I feel, Adrian. I, I tried playing um, Silent Hill 2, and once I got to the school with all the dead kids and stuff, like, it was just... I couldn't do it at that point. Uh, did I save? I don't think I saved. The stream is done. I actually watched the entirety of it. The entirety of just Resident Evil 1 or the entirety of the streams? Because that's, um... That's a lot of streams. I think I've done... We, we talked about it last night. I've done over like 110 streams at this point. And that's... I mean, that's small peanuts compared to, to big streamers. But I'm proud of myself. I've got massive ADD issues. So usually when I start something, I, I don't finish it. But I'm like five months into this. My first ever video... First ever YouTube video was December 9th, 2023. And I think my first stream was in January. So, a little, I mean, they're a little, they're a little controversial, but they do make sense in the story because the whole city is dead. So it would kind of make sense that there's dead kids. It is kind of fucked up to put them in the game though. I'm going to keep, I'm just going to keep the guns I have on me. Yeah. Bring the MO disc. Go out, do the MO disc. Oh, just this stream? I mean, RE1's been 
been really great so far. <laughs> I love that you... <laughs> oh, James, I love that you specify that there's zombie kids that you can kill. <laughs> Bring the self-defense gun? Okay, I do want to ask about this. So, Wesker, what is the self-defense gun? Like, is there a reason for it? Because you only get one shot, and it's a tiny little derringer. So, like, what is the, the whole point of that gun? Well, of course we're going to acknowledge you, Miracle. You are in the chat. Once you join the chat, you're, you're one of us. You are one of us. One of us. All right. Well, I know James has played it. Is there a significance to the Derringer? Uh, I think, yeah, here it is. Use that. That'll open up the second lock on the door. All right. And then the third one is in one of the furnace rooms. Man, we're burning through this game. And I've only died once. I'm proud of myself. One death Resident Evil? Hopefully I get the tyrant fight at the end, too. Okay. Um, let's see. Do we have any keys or anything on me? Yeah, that's a good point. That is a good point. A lot of people don't feel seen. It's nice to be acknowledged by, you know, the streamer that you're watching. Like, I, I've, I've watched a few streams and, and popped in chat a few times. And, you know, when the streamer says something like, like, Senpai noticed me, you know? Like, they'll respond to the thing that I said. And it's like, oh my god, they saw what I said. But these, these were, like, big streamers. So, you know, I got all giddy. Maybe giddy is not the right word to use for an adult man. No, I'm gonna stick by it. I'm gonna stick by it. I got giddy. Okay, now this is Cockroach Central. Actually, I probably should have just brought the third MO disc. Where's the cockroach? One. What? What? What the shit? I didn't know he could just go back up into the ceiling. Oh my god. There we go. Oh, excuse you. Blast him away. So, what the fuck? I don't think these guys are infinite. I think they, I think we can kill them all. But I gotta remember the the last mo is oh shit right. and he's dead. Wow, they usually take two hits. Why are they taking three? That's kind of crazy. Okay, we need the capsule. Fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. Refueling device for the room. It's not working right now because there's no fuel. There's no there's an empty capsule. Okay. Um. Oh, with the the little derringer? Cuz that thing it's a 22 caliber gun. So That's definitely not Swagnum level. Oh Jesus. Oh, oh, one shot. One shot is down. Look at that shit. Look at that. I think we can clear out the cockroaches that used to be humans. The human, the cock, human roaches. Oh, Jesus. Fuck off. No, no, come back on. Come back. Come here. Where'd he go? Oh shit! That was my last bullet! 
Oh shit! Oh shit! Um, we have to use the swag. Woo. Woo. Oh no, you don't. Bam! What? What? That dude just tanked a swagnum shot? Oh no. No, 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 no. That's not cool. That's not cool at all. See, that is should is should be what happened. What? Words. That's what should happen. It should immediately blow their heads off and they be done. How did he tank the shot like that? That was crazy. Maybe I didn't hit him in the right spot. Boom! Boom! Absolutely, Miracle. We will see you when you get back. Combine, swag them. Oh, that's right. I said I was going to save the last six rounds for the Tyrant. Well, well, we're going to have to do that. All right. Uh... I need to fill the the fuel thing. But I still need to do the last MO disc. But I, I want to try and take care of the the cockroaches. Because we're going to have to come back through here with the fuel capsule. We have some destruct mechanism. Um, there's no loot here. No power to the main. Start it up. Okay. I wonder... Hmm. I guess we can try using the barrier on, on the tyrant. See what happens. <laughs> Chris shoots Mia to have even take Claire. That's, got, that's funny. That's funny. I like that. Yeah, I remember watching that video. That was pretty funny. Okay, so I think we've killed all the cockro cockroach guys. I, as I say that, there's another cockroach guy. Where is he? And here's the MO disc. Okay, I need to go grab that disc. There he is. Oop, oop. Uh, okay, so pretty much guaranteed two acid shots takes care of them, but I only have two left. Shit. Shit. And we're saving the swagdom for uh, for the tyrant, so... That's fine. It's fine. We'll go pick up the MO. We'll do that. Um, I can't do the fuel rod yet because I need the MO disc to get through to the fuel rod room. So, as is with every Resident Evil, there is backtracking. Always backtracking. The pistol? I mean, yeah, we could use the pistol. I'm definitely going to try the, the Derringer on the... Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put the shotgun away. I need the MO disc... One shot, really, really strong. 255 rounds. <laughs> For real. Um, I think I have more. I have incendiary rounds. I should have, like, some regular grenades, too, shouldn't I? I thought I did. I do, yeah. I do. Okay. All right. We're making progress. We're doing it. It's actually timing quite well for the stream, too. Let's see. That door up there is blocked, so... What is this back here? This is the elevator thing, isn't it? Yeah. Can't do anything with this yet. Calls the 22 the most powerful round. It's it's the smallest. So yeah, I'm going to use it on the Tyrant then. I'm going to save the Swagnum still, but I'm going to use it on the Tyrant. Okay. It's in the next room. We 
We do the MO disc. You think the stream is slow for me? It is it is behind for me. What does it say for you? Yeah, it's uh like seven and a half minutes behind for me. Is it looking good for everybody else? Just in case. What is the last thing you saw me do? Let me know when you see me unlock the third lock. It should only be about a six second delay for you. Yeah, so you guys are good. On your end, it's... Oh, and we're up to 10 viewers. Hell yeah. Um, yeah, so on your side, it's good. On my side, it's like seven and a half minutes behind. And I, I have no idea. Why. No idea why. So I don't know, like... I don't see any actual issues on my side, since they're just not going to happen. Unlocked. Uncocked. Well, that's a word. Okay, so we gotta go fill the fuel rod. <laughs> I didn't expect... Th Wait, there's a chicken emoji? Or a rooster emoji? I didn't know that was a thing. Okay, where was that door again? It is... Down this way through here it may almost be easier to use the tank controls but I hate the tank controls so much because we're going to have to walk with it lock blah 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 there's a gorilla how do you know Pull it. And one more. I'm just unlocking this for, for now. Um, we don't go through there to do the fuel rod. We go in here, I think. I believe this is the fuel rod. Yeah, on my little like preview window, I just killed one of the cockroach guys. So uh, my shit is definitely, definitely behind. Okay, we need to fill the thing. Put the thing in. Fuel it. Fuel supply sprinting will make it explode. Oh boy. What is that? Is that... Is that an otter? Where did you find an otter? Are there just animal emojis? Is that a thing? I, I'm not that familiar with YouTube's emojis, so... That's a sea otter? Okay, that's pretty great. That's pretty great. I commend you for the sea otter. And the gorilla. And the rooster. That's pretty great. I do kind of wish there so Twitch streaming does have like better use of emojis and stuff. I do kind of feel like YouTube is a little behind on that cuz I don't think you can do like the animated emojis and everything on YouTube that you can with Twitch. My evil twin Jack Baker is going to join my <laughs> What? Are you switching to your alt to play the game? Yeah, I know Twitch has got, like, really, really good emojis and stuff, but um, I don't know if YouTube does. I don't know. I'm not to that point. You have to have 500 subscribers before you can unlock the emojis and whatnot, so. Okay, we're making good progress. I feel like I should save. I'm going to save. Just in case. Because the last time I did this, like, I made a Twitch and I exploded, so I'm definitely going to save. 
There we go. My chair got all messed up here. Don't run. Don't run. We've got volatile fuel on us. Nope, I fucked that up. Ink rivets. Don't run, don't run, don't run. There we go. What are we at? 26 saves, I think. 25. And I think this is probably like my last save, maybe. Near it. We basically just have the tyrant fight after this. Um, is that a, is that an owl? I love it. Absolutely. I think it's an owl. Or maybe it's a, a bear eating candy. A blue bear eating candy. I'm reading messages like a few minutes after they're sent. When did you send that? Seriously, is it actually seven minutes behind? I don't think it is. Is the chat super behind? It's a pillow? Okay, I'm gonna say, right, just to, just to test the speed of what's going on, type in the word brownie in the chat. What is up, Davin? Davin, da Alan, what's up, Alan? Welcome back to the chat. Yeah, type brownie into the chat. I want to see how much of a delay there is. Oh no, nobody's typing it. So either I am super behind or everyone is collectively fucking with me. Which is also possible. But it is also possible that YouTube is just lagging behind. Okay, let's go through here. Oh, wait, no, I think I get the capsule in the first room. Yep. No, I messed that up. I gotta go back through the first room. It's kind of behind. Everything is normal for you. I was in the restroom just now, so I couldn't. Hmm. I don't know how to fix that because the bit rate on my side is good and and YouTube says excellent connection so I don't know how to fix that oh my god I almost just died there and I feel like if I refresh my page it won't actually do anything let me try let me try I'm gonna try to Okay, I think I think my shit has caught up now on my side. I refreshed my page and my shit caught up on my side. Yeah. Okay. Wait, okay, so Oh shit. We've got Wesker and Wesker's alter ego. Oh, shit's going down now. We got to turn the power on for the elevator. What is up, Wesker's buddy, brother, twin? Alter ego. I got new people in the chat. We got OGs in the chat. Today is a good day. I'm having a good stream. I don't know about you guys, but I'm having a good stream. I'm enjoying myself. We've had great chat. 
A lot of good people coming through. This is a good time. This is a good time. Let's do the elevator. Just checking in on what you're doing. Okay, the elevator is up. Yeah, my stream is caught up, so... Just don't cause problems. <laughs> that sounds like something that I would... Uh, that I would say to my brother. Like, okay, it's fine that you're here. Just don't, don't talk shit to anybody. Don't, don't pick a fight. All right. So the elevators are now unlocked. Man, YouTube does not make sense. One of them says concurrent viewers is nine. One says 12. Once the other one says 12. It's amazing that we're up to 12, by the way. Let's fucking go. Okay, I think um, I think the tyrant fight is next. So should I save the Derringer for like the full blown tyrant fight, or should I just should I do it while he, like right after he kills Wesker? That's the question. It was you, Wesker, the whole time. Of course. Of course. You can never trust a Wesker. Never trust a Wesker. All right. I feel like I need to take it with me. Let's bring it with. Self-defense gun. Let's examine it. I haven't really looked at it much. 22 Magnum Double Dillinger. It's so ridiculous. I love this little thing. I feel like... So we should be getting the, the actual... Like, tyrant fight, right? Now? Hopefully someone can confirm that. Because I want to save it for the actual tyrant fight. <laughs> Thank you, H! Thank you so much. You're going to make me blush. Look forward to seeing more of your fanatics join. <laughs> Welcome back, too. We haven't seen you in chat in a while. Okay, we're at 27 saves. As long as we can do it in less than 36, we should be okay. And Jill is better than Chris. Um, Am I going to need items? I'm going to need some space here. I've been trolled. I have been trolled. That crafty, crafty Wesker trolled me. Oh, let's leave these two slots open for loot. Loot opportunities. They are both evil twins. Okay, so this elevator should be good. We're saved. Press the switch. Yes. Yes, this should take us down where the Tyrant and Wesker is. Elevator is working. Jill. Barry. Barry. You could have at least waited up for me, you know? Let's go. Maybe because you left me in the fucking caverns with Lisa. Good luck, man. Ethan must die. Good luck. You have... You're a masochist. Full-on masochist. Don't forget to save Chris. How do we save Chris? Did we get, like, a prompt to save Chris? How do we save Chris? Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Where Where do we save Chris? Cuz it, it if it if it's in the mansion I don't think we've gotten any prompt to save him or anything. So Maybe I should look this up. Oh, my phone is blown up. How to save Chris. Oh, 
Oh, that's right. He's in jail. It's just like how we save Jill. Okay. I knew that. I knew that. Oh, there'd be loot in this room. Where be the loot in this room? Shotgun rounds. Oh, I should have brought the shotgun. Should I go back and get the shotgun? I kind of want to. Yeah, I agree. I've seen that before. I agree. Well, it was good seeing you, Adrian. Uh, hopefully we can see you on the next stream tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m. or whatever that translates to your time. Um, and it's going to be a, a new game. So, Wesker, let's go. Thank you, Barry. Are you fucking... Oh, what do you know? Oh. oh, don't blame Barry for everything. I hear that his better half and two lovely daughters will be in danger if he doesn't do everything I tell him to. Barry... Oh. Betrayed us? Oscar, you're pathetic. Well, you shouldn't worry too much, dear. <sighs> You'll be free of all this anyway. Why eliminate stars? Believe it or not, that's Umbrella's intention. Thank you, Adrian. Thank you. <laughs> and he's already got the swag. Slave of umbrella. Smart girl. But I think you misunderstand. Damn it. Fucking Barry. I like Barry. Nothing. I'll burn all of them along with this entire laboratory. Barry, go up on the ground and wait there. I don't need two people pointing guns at my head, Barry. thank you. <laughs> you gotta love Barry. He must really be afraid of Umbrella. You and Umbrella took his family, you bastard. Oh. <laughs> Umbrella? Well, I used some carrots and sticks to cow him, but it had what nothing is, to do with What is Umbrella. cowing? I just used Barry for my personal interests. Though both you and Barry seem to think I was following Umbrella's orders. What? What? What are you planning? I guess it's time for show and tell. And the tyrant. We're definitely using the swagnum against the tyrant. Is it just me or does it look like the tyrant's body is covered in titties? It might just be me. Like, just in that one shot. It's magnificent. For the sake of this thing. You know, I hate goodbyes. Oh, God, these are Boom! Let's go, Barry! Let's go! Barry! My boy! Forgive me. That's just me? No, you're not to blame. Yeah. It's Umbrella and Wesker. Even if it meant my family, I couldn't bear turning my back on my friends again. Oh, shit. Shit! Oh, shit! So, I wonder if Barry fights... Does he assist me in the fight, I wonder? Damn it! <laughs> shoot, Barry, shoot! <laughs> Jill and Barry together in hell. <laughs> Jill and Barry together in you want hell. Want a piece of me? What? Premature. Premature. Ooh, he's got the Albert. No, Barry. You viral cultured freak. What? Oh, I love these one-liners. Uh, let's see. Let's let's use the swag. Oh shit! Ouch! Okay, we dump him for that fight, and hopefully we do get the Barry. final fight. Barry. Oh, I lost a leg. <sighs> Ouch. Uh. You're okay. Uh, Jill. Sorry. Tommy just got knocked in the head. He's fine. That was careless of me. Wesker. Oh, shit. He's gone. Of course First, he's gone. He's Wesker. Let's just get out of here. 
Okay. Let's see, I've got one bullet left for the swagnum. Um, there's no loot in this room. I thought there was a key or something, wasn't there? Because there's a key that you get from Wesker's body that opens doors for you. Electronic locks have been released. Okay. Maybe that's it, I guess. I could have sworn... First blood. Well, good luck. Oh, I hope I get the final fight Final fight with the tight... The, the... Jesus. Words. The tyrant. The final fight with the tyrant. Okay, we gotta... We have to save Chris. Wesker must have set it off. Let's hurry. Let's go. Hopefully this just isn't a cut. Like, is it going to give me the opportunity to save Chris? I hope so. Second death. Cutscenes. Okay. Self destruct has been activated. Oh shit. Um, should I save? I don't think I need to save. Maybe I should save. No, I don't need to save. Um, let's see. I want to combine those with that. Let's store these. Uh, keep the healing item. Store the swagnum. I don't have the bullets. Store the pistol. Deja vu. Grab the shotgun. And that should be it. That should be all I need. Yep, that's where I'm going to head. But we don't have a key, so... Well, actually, I'm going to grab that extra ammo for the grenade launcher. Incendiary rounds. There we go. Alright. Let's go. Let's go finish this game. Hopefully this isn't actually timed. We need to go... This way. All locks released. I'm gonna go save Chris. Oh, great. I'm just not gonna fuck with it. Just not gonna deal with him. Oh, yeah, that refresh really fucks up stuff. Go through here. I think this is where Chris is. If I remember correctly, I think this is where Chris is. He should be down these stairs and in the cell. Yes. Lock is released. Jill, we got Chris. Chris you're okay. We got Chris. Glad to Pro see gamer. you. Pro gamer. Anything on Wesker? We'll talk later. First, let's get going. Okay. Now I gotta try and remember which elevator it is that gets us out. There's loot in that room. Oh no 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 no! I'm not leaving that. I'm not leaving that. We're finishing this game with no loot. What is in here? Shotgun rounds! Let's go! Is that it? Is that it? Is that, it? Is that everything? Yes, that's everything. Okay. Alright. Let's go! Okay, it's this way. I think we need to go back upstairs. To that other door upstairs. 
There was an elevator, I think. If I remember correctly, I'm trying to remember where exactly to go. Come on, let's go. Um, yeah, I think it's upstairs. It's it's that one. I think. So we should go this way. I don't like that the self-destruct thing keeps going after while you're going through door animation. Let's see. Can I go through? Oh, that was a mistake. Why did I go through here? No! Go back through. Quick, quick! All right, where do we need to go? Here? Ladder. Did I save recently? No, I'm gonna try to do it without saving. Oh, timing is working really well on this. We should go back up this way, back up to that elevator that we couldn't use. Unless I'm on, absolutely on, going hurry. the wrong way, which no, I'm not. Okay. Did not find out the problem? Hard to say. Hard to say. Um, I think I'm actually going to be able to pick all this up. We might actually be able to do this. I think just yours was delayed. I mean, mine was too, so maybe it happened to everybody. Hard to say. Okay, let's go. Come on. Come on. I think I might actually be able to get all the loot. You have to go to YouTube Studio to find out. Final battle time, let's go. I agree. Hopefully we actually get the tyrant fight. Because as Chris, we completely skipped it. Why does it still say there's loot in this room? Where is it? Oh, here we go. Hopefully this is it. Yes! We're finishing the game with no loot left. Let's go! Let's fucking go! Pro gamer! Damn it! We're almost there! Jill, you just get in contact with Brad. No! We can make it. Barry? Jill, ladies first. Oh, Chris. Chris! Thank you. Would you let me have my moments, too? All right. We'll rendezvous at the heliport. <laughs> what are these lines? <laughs> Would you let me have my moments, too? Did both Barry and Chris need to leave, though? I mean, the elevator's literally coming down. Two, wait, we have- there's a timer? Oh shit. Am I gonna have to beat the tyrant in a timer? Oh boy. Uh, equip. We gotta do the thing. Signal rockets. Where's the tyrant? Bro, please tell me I get to fight him. Hmm? Jill! You made it. Yes! Yes! Finally! 
Let's go. Oh shit. Oh, Chris just got bitch slapped. Just bear, no, Barry, you got a bullets. Okay, that that swagdom didn't do anything. The sw <laughs> the little swagdom didn't do anything. I just hit him in the asshole and it didn't do anything. Damn. Okay, where's he at? What? What? Ouch! Oh my god. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is not going well. This is going very badly. In fact... Why do they keep missing like that? No, 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 no! No! Oh. I don't think I saved. I didn't think I needed to save. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Yeah, he's ridiculous. He moves so fast. I did not expect him to move that fast. Oh, no. Holy shit. Um. Let's see, I'll have time between now and then to pick that up again. And those. Ah. Uh, I needed more. I needed more powerful weapons, is what I needed. Store pistol, use the Derringer. Well, the. The Derringer. Like, should I use the Derringer during the final Tyrant fight? Or should I use it during that, like, during that, like, first fight? So, is it just a joke gun, then? The Derringer? Jill. Game over. <laughs> Thank you, Ahmed. Thank you. During final fight, use Derringer during first fight. Okay. Well, maybe I need to go back because I didn't bring it. First, let's grab this shotgun ammo. <laughs> you are all good, Miracle. You are all good. Well, let's, let's go grab the Derringer and we'll try it on the first fight. See what happens. Because, yeah, it didn't do shit during that second fight. Maybe because I shot him in the ass. Like, right in the ass cheek. Maybe that's why it didn't work. Derringer in the final fight. <sighs> yeah... Well, I can at least grab the shotgun. I'm going to grab the shotgun. That's true. We can't kill him in the first fight. So, we'll try it in the second fight. Oh, my God. Camera. Uh, but I do want my shotgun. Combine that with that. I'm going to keep the pistol on me, though, because... Fuck, I feel like I'm, I just don't have enough ammo for that fight. Maybe, I think maybe the reason it didn't work is because I shot him in the ass. I think that might be it. If I shoot him in the front, it might actually do something. Just maybe. 
Oh yeah, I've got a ridiculous amount of ammunition for my for the main pistol. Like 255 rounds. It's it's ridiculous. And this stack is is maxed out. So there's actually more ammo in my storage room. It's magnificent. Because Oh, you fucker. Ow, god dang. No, 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 come on, dude. Why does the shotgun suck? Damn. Okay, he's done. How am I doing on health? I'm on caution. Uh, let's go around, release the locks. Where's the lock thing? Is it over here? Is this it? This is it. Yes. All right. Yeah, I, I, I do have a ridiculous amount of ammo. In the final fight, heal every time he hits you? Barry. Shit. Barry. I don't think I can carry enough healing <sighs> items. Uh, you're okay. Uh, Jill, sorry. I can try. He's careless of me. What? We'll definitely try. I wish I could just kill him here. I feel like I do need to bring the pistol and the pistol ammo, though, just in case. Oh, yeah. Crotch shots are, are a staple with Resident Evil. Okay. Let's grab the stuff we need. I'm going to save just in case I lose to that fight again. Because he moves so fast. I did not expect him to move so fast. I really did not expect that. Combine here. Uh, save, 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 save. Oh yeah, and I gotta save Chris too. So were you like when you when you type in chat, were you using like um, like text to speech? I wonder if that could do it. Okay, we're at twenty eight saves. We're still under the thirty six we had with Chris. All right, we need to bring like everything that we can. Um. I feel like acid's not gonna be good again. Just using the microphone button on mobile. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, let's let's bring the grenade shells. Combine with this. Uh, let's bring the incendiary shells. And there's two heals. There's two heals we pick up on the way. So. Oh, shit. Fuck. Because I don't want to leave any loot either. Yeah, I've got a ton of heals. I'm gonna have to go up and pick up that stuff. Pistol's not strong enough, like at all. Does it not do any damage? Well, that frees up two slots then, I guess. All right, so we'll dump the pistol, dump the ammo. We'll just have the swagnum, the grenade launcher, and the shotgun. Hopefully that'll do it. Yeah. And I'll carry two heals on me. There's two heals that we pick up in that hallway, so.
Well, the problem is, like he was saying, is the, the pistol is super weak, so... Maybe I should have brought another heal. I should have brought another heal. Just not gonna waste ammo on these guys. I guess we'll see if uh, if two heals is enough. Unfortunately not. Unfortunately not. Just because there's such limited inventory space and I need ammo and uh, and bullets. People kill a tyrant with a knife? Wow. Wow. That is um, humbling. Very humbling. Let's just say, we'll put it that way. We'll put it that way. It's just, it's not, it's a hit to the pride. Right in the pride. Okay, I know there's some kind of loot in this room. Oh, okay. That would make sense. Okay, we've got some extra shotgun rounds. And I think there's more shotgun rounds and two heals as we go up. God damn, he moves so quick. For a game that moves so slow, he moves ridiculously quick. I say we open with the grenade launch. I forgot the Derringer. I'm gonna open with the grenade launcher. Or maybe open with the shotgun. Or open with the swagnum. Maybe I should open with the swagnum. It doesn't matter. I'm going to use up all my damn ammo anyways. Doesn't matter what I open with at all. Damn, we're up to 70 views this stream. Let's go. Imagine having 70 people in here. Just imagine that. 10 times the amount of people that are currently here. That'd be mind blowing. Absolutely mind blowing. I don't know how they do it, bigger streamers. I've seen like Dr. Disrespect have like 30,000 people in his stream. How do you do that? Like, how can you focus on that at all? Having 30,000 people watching you. Why did I do this? Oh no, coming here was fine. I'm gonna save. Because we're, we're right here at the bottom. So I'm going to save. Yeah, let's put those there. And they only have the knife. How, how do they do that? That's ridiculous. How can they kill the tower with just a knife? It, it is it's crazy what people can do with these games. How good people get. Okay. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go. Let's kill us a tyrant. Come on, come on, hurry! Say, bring the knife? No, no. I'm nowhere near good enough for the knife. I haven't even really used it throughout the entirety of this game, so. Maybe since they're giving me shotgun shells, it's like a, a sign that I should use the shotgun. Hopefully these are good heals and not just one plant. I don't know what the RNG is on these. Well, that's good. That's good. Hopefully this one's better than just one plant. You beat it again? Holy shit. Oh, there's only one green herb? Ah, oh, that's fine, I guess. Congrats to Wesker! Holy shit! He beat Ethan Must Die again! Let's go! I, oh, come on, I'm only gonna have one heal? Great. Just great. This isn't gonna go well. This is not going to go well. Three minutes.
Oh, I see. Okay, that makes sense. I can type fairly fast, but then there's... I don't have the Derringer. I didn't bring it. 23 minutes and 19 seconds. That's that's kind of crazy. I, I brought as many weapons as I felt I should because I still need a heal. All right. Let's see. Take the signal rockets. Yes. I do have the Swagnum, so we're using the Swagnum. Is there anything around here? Like any loot around here? Normally... For a Resident Evil boss fight, they'd have, like, ammo and, and health and stuff. So, shit. All right. Here we go. You've beat, so you've seen some people beat it in six minutes? Six minutes! Come on, turn towards me. Let's try shotgun. Oh, oh no, 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 ouch. Oh my God, he just yoked me. Full on yote. Damn. Oh, Jill, <gasps> use it. what is that? It, whatever it is. What? Bro, bro. Is this what I think it is? This is a motherfucking rocket launcher. Let's go, pro gamer. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> okay. So that starts the tradition of Resident Evil killing the final boss with a rocket launcher. Let's go. What's up? Game over. Let's go. Right at three hours, too. All right. Basement theme one more time. <laughs> All right. When we get back to the main menu. Oh, shit. And her costume changed. That resident really was evil. We saved Barry, we saved Chris. But the world is still gonna end, unfortunately. There's a spot on my monitor. Wow. Overcomplicating it, it as usual. The final boss is easy. I was just way up in my head. Yeah, that's possible. Jill, Best end. You did a fine job. Lost thousands of pounds of ammo in a crate. Eight hours and 25 minutes. I beat this one like three hours faster than, um, than with Chris. I got the closet key. There we go, finally. Until next time, Resident Evil series. Yeah, yeah, we just beat this, so, um... Yes. So next is Evil Within. Tomorrow night, 7.30 p.m., we are starting Evil Within. And just to mark that occasion, we're going to play... This fucking song. This fucking song. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so great. It's so wonderful. <laughs> and actually, you know what? I normally end the stream in three hours, but... I do, I want to do a round of mercenaries. So I got to change my game capture to any full screen application. And we're going to do some mercenaries. 
We're going to do like a round of mercenaries. Uh, Miracle, there's probably not going to be a stream tonight. Um, I've got, we're doing some stuff with friends. So there may not be a stream tonight. Depends on how those plans play out. But there will be a stream tomorrow night. Shit, there was a sale on Steam? I did not know there was a sale on Steam. I, I knew there was a first person sale on Steam. I didn't know Callisto Protocol was on sale. I'll have to double check it. Oh yeah, we should do that too. Next time, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely check it out next time. Let's see. Resident Evil 1 voice acting. Ten minute cut. Jill sandwich scene. I'll have to find a good one. But first, let's do a round of mercenaries. Let me know if it's too loud, though. I have yet to do... Oh, I got more S's than I thought I did. Uh, let's do castle. I only got an A. Uh, let's try Lewis. Oh, you just joined the Discord? What's up? Let's go. Welcome to the Discord. Let's see. I'm going to turn it down a little bit. Uh, audio, master volume. Let's drop it down a bit. There we go. Oh my god. I'm not used to keyboard and mouse right now. Dick. Oh no! What just happened? Do I have, I, okay, I do have healing items. Ouch! Come on! I'm not used to playing Lewis. Fuck. Fuck. I'm much better with Leon or Ada. Gotta get the chicken. Oh, Jesus! Bam! Why, thank you. Come on, let's get... Where did he get the pipe? Oh, my God. I, I kind of want to... Let's see, parts. Take this off. Oh my god, I missed both shots? Seriously? Oh my god. Let's get you guys grouped together a little bit. Oh, I dropped it! I dropped it! <laughs> Dude, seriously? I'm so bad with Lewis, holy shit! Oh my god, are you kidding me? Yes, yes, that is accurate. It is very accurate. I am being fucking slaughtered. Oh, home! Home run. Oh! Come on, dude. Of course. Of course. Oh. 
excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. <laughs> yes, uh, Miracle, you are 100% correct. What am I doing? I have a rifle. There it goes. Can I jump down? Nope. Oh, oh I'm gonna pick one. Why did I put that down? Oh, oh shit. Oh, go, 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 come on. Fire, I'm on fire. Use. There we go. There we go. Now we're getting a groove. No, 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 no. I had a groove. I had a groove. Oh, oh, big guy, big guy. Hey, <laughs> late. Oh, Jesus. Go, 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 move, move, move. Um, what's the best course of action here? Oh, I've got more points than I thought I did. Come on, get closer, get closer, get closer. Run. Excuse you. Excuse me. Would you just... God damn it. Excuse me, sir. Oh, ho, 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 Oh, one shot. Let's go. Oh, my God. I missed every shot. What the hell is that up there? Oh, that's the guy that makes those things. I forgot about those guys. Oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. Excuse me, sir. Take that. Oh, red herb combine. Let's see, craft mixed herb. I think I'm doing okay. Maybe a little okay. Oh, now that was a shot right there. Let's go. Oh, Jesus. What? What? Oh, no! Oh, Lewis. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, I got Krauser, though. That's pretty cool. Let's do... Let's try the docks as Krauser. What does he have? He has a bow and arrow, a smig, and a knife. I can't believe it ate my head. It literally ate my head. I've never fought with a bow and arrow before, so... I unlocked a hand cannon? In what, though? How do I use the hand cannon?
All right, he's just gonna fall over. Also, how does Krauser? Oh, it must be the. Oh, boom! You do the melee. Why did the melee prop not come up? What the fuck? Oh, that's annoying. Extra content shot for the campaign. Oh, for the campaign. Excuse you. Oh my god. Ouch. Bam. Ouch. No, 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 no. Ten kills. I love doing melee kills because they, they get those combos like that. Let's see, let's try this bow. Whoa! Excuse you. Oh my god, are you serious? Oh! Bro! 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 That was amazing! Holy shit, fucking Krauser does not fuck around. Let's go! No, no, no. No, no, no. No, you don't. There you go. He can do that in the campaign, actually. That 100% happens. Multiple melee. Oh, uh, let's see. I'm just gonna do this. I don't deal with that. Is that a is that a chainsaw guy? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh come on, dude! Fuck off! No 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 no. Go, 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 get out of the way. Go, 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 go. Excuse me. There's a chainsaw guy behind me. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Okay, there's that. That was good. That was good. That was good. That was good. We're good. There's double chainsaw guys? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. He's... He is a hundred percent infected. Yeah, he's he's been infected for a while. I think. Mayhem mode. Let's go. Boom! Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. That was fantastic. That was good. That was good. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that's not cool. Let's go. He has a two-bladed chainsaw? That's pretty brutal. Fuck, 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 fuck. Melee. Melee. Boom! What's that noise? What is that noise? Bam. Bam. Oh shit! I didn't see that guy. Um, let's use that. Do a lot of the things in these games remind me of prototype. I 100% agree with that.
big bladed guy. That didn't go well. <sighs> Damn, that was my fault. Hey, I got Hunk! Hunk is not only a high performance submachine gun, but also a unique melee attack that can kill instantly. During mayhem mode, he gains unlimited ammo? Bro, bro, let's go pro gamer. Unlimited ammo? Okay, so we've got just our smig. I want to see this. Bam! I want to see this melee attack, though. Let me, let me get that. Did that knife just come out of my sleeve? Let's go! Oh, melee from behind. I see what you're saying. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Damn, this submachine gun is fucking tough. Okay, this punk is amazing. Oh, Jesus! Ouch, ouch. <laughs> no, 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 no. Do I have any healing items? I have one. Let's go. I gotta get some more time. What game is this? This is Resident Evil 4 Remake. Of course, I'm on fire. Stun big guy in melee from behind? Uh, I don't know how I can stun him. No, no. That didn't work. Uh, this is Resident Evil 4 Remake. Is that dynamite? That's dynamite. Oh, oh. Nope, that didn't work. Great, a chainsaw guy. Chainsaw guy. Oh shit. Shoot him in the face and then melee for a unique melee. Okay. Oh, excuse me. They drop green herbs? Okay, we gotta get that chainsaw guy taken care of first.
This this theme song almost sounds like Mortal Kombat. Like just almost. Oh, let's go! Oh shit, 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 shit. Reload, reload. I'm digging Hulk. Hunk. Hulk? Hunk? Hunk. I like this guy. This this SMG, this fucking smith is tough. We need to go up. Oh great. Excuse me. Excuse me. into a corner here. Punk. Right? This mode is so ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And I love it. I don't know why I did Oh Jesus! No 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 no! Go through the window! Fuck, 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 fuck! Oh my god, go through the window! Why won't you go through the window? Oh, this is not a good situation. Perfect time for unlimited ammo. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I, I actually am pretty good with the uh, really lucky blocks in this game. Like, it's. I beat Krauser with a lucky block and a sniper rifle shot. And Krauser is basically a melee range fight, and I beat him with a sniper rifle shot. What other enemy is there? Is that the two chainsaw chicks? It is. Do the melee! Oh no! Never mind! I think this is the most points I've gotten so far. I've never broken 500,000. But I saw on the leaderboards, there's this one guy on the... Um, did I unlock Mafia and Leon? Not yet. Oh my god, let me fucking pass. I don't actually... I don't know how to. I don't think it says. Or maybe you have to get like S tier and all of them with Leon. God, I have so many dreamers. Whoops, excuse me, excuse me, sir.
Oh, let's go! Oh shit, 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 shit! Oh! Pro gamer, let's fucking go! Holy shit! Ouch, ouch. I didn't know that there was a finite amount of it. I got it! Plus! <laughs> oh, yeah, we're ending the stream on that. Okay, that's a high point. That's a fucking high point. Pro Gamer S Plus, let's go! Whew! Look at that! Holy shit! Uh, all right that um we're ending the stream here um hunk is amazing <laughs> why you gotta do that wesker what the fuck uh what do i get with an s plus I, I don't know i don't know oh wesker always always keeping me in check keeping me in check um i didn't see any weapons unlock i didn't see anything else unlock so so I don't think so. But man, Hunk is is OP. Just like Wesker is OP with uh with melee. So I think I'm definitely gonna be playing some more Hunk. But that will do it for the stream tonight, today, this morning. Uh bragging rights, yeah, that's a good point. Um, so there probably won't be a stream tonight, depending on what uh what happens. We may be uh doing some stuff tonight because we're doing some some stuff tomorrow morning so i may be staying uh, at a different place tonight but thank you everybody in chat thank you everybody for watching i love you guys thank you everybody new in chat for stopping by watching the stream talking in chat especially if you subbed um since i usually do forget to say it like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the show um i'm gonna start rambling so next episode of the stream is tomorrow night 7 30 p.m whatever that translates to your time um for me, it's 12.34 p.m., so whatever that translates to your time. But, yes, I will schedule it on the channel. So if you miss... Uh, I saw the few minutes after I started watching. I'll see what I can do about finding some good uh, some good of the, the voice actor RE1 stuff. But, yeah, tomorrow we are starting a new game. We are starting uh, The Evil Within number one. I'm stoked to start it. I know nothing about the game other than it's fucked up. Um, I think James started playing it a little bit, but that's that's about all I know. So it's going to be a true, complete blind playthrough for everybody. But I'm going to start rambling. I love you guys. I will see you guys on the next stream.